Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is a barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of uh, excitement and expectation. The Emirates Stadium in all its glorious modernity, this symbol of new Arsenal, the Arsenal of the 21st century. This is a friendly, but a friendly only in May. I'm sitting here, Peter, thinking, is it possible for these two to meet under friendly circumstances? This exhibition match is likely to exhibit the same old rivalry. To me, it also has the same feel to it. And I'm pretty sure we can look forward to what will be a combative, high-intensity affair. We can't really say anything negative about this. And if it is full-on, then I'll be happy to watch that. to get inside the ground tonight for a much anticipated game the uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic the car parks are full there is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station and we expect every seat to be filled an atmosphere of the shoots it's in and some of the best managers I played for insisted on starting games as you mean to go on. And we've just seen a very important opening goal from an extremely talented individual who looks primed for more. He really does look at it. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. And they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. Oh, he did the hard part right, but fluffed the finish. It didn't quite come. And it's Odoi. Press Piliqueta. Now it's Batshuayi. Out towards the flank. Opportunity for Arsenal to break. Gets it back. Lacazette. Aimed long and direct. And the counter is on. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. And it's Aubameyang. Now it's Lacazette. Lacazette! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Lacazette sparked a tremendous stop there, and I think it's fair to add, he just wasn't expecting it. Pepe. Good running with the ball, can they build? Fires from distance. Arsenal are level. And the goal still quivers with the sheer ferocity of the strike. Well, with the defence facing him, he had to get that right, and he did. I thought that was a very well worked goal. Arsenal grab the equaliser and we're all square. Yeah, it's a very good contest with two very good sides and with such great individual talent on show, it could go either way. Now it's Aubameyang. Has a look and has a go. Oh, just wide. 
Oh, how close was that to going in? It only required the smallest of tweaks. Odoi. And it's Marcos Alonso. Hector Behrin. You see, it's a free kick for that. There could be trouble here. And for now, the referee is keeping his cards in his pocket. Great leap! Great early ball. Same can't be said for the finish. Well, if only the calibre of the finish was as high as the, the calibre of the supply. I mean, it was a beautifully played cross and really should have seen something better on the end of it. He's left his man. He's Ando Bamian! It's a goal! They've done it! It was coming! They have their reward! Aubameyang showed real composure then. I mean, how often do you see a player do everything right until he gets into the box, only to completely kind of fluff the finish? Not him. Arsenal get themselves into the lead. Yeah, for me, this team seems to find it easier to attack than defend, but now they're going to need to dig in at the back a bit. Oh, he's gone for it! Oh, and he's got good distance. Who's chasing? Ceballos belts one. Good stop. That wasn't easy. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment. He simply had Pepe. Challenge, but fair enough. And the first 45 minutes are up. Well, what a comeback. Certainly, I didn't see that coming, nor I think did many in this crowd. Best way to describe that. Frantic, um, frenzied. It was unmissable and it was irresistible. Forget about the analysis on this one, just enjoy it. Arsenal head into the half-time break with a narrow lead, two goals to one. So we're just settling back into this second half. Tierney tries to get it forward quickly. Shapes to shoot. A great save, real class. Well, to be honest, he shouldn't have spilled that in the first place, but he recovered it really quickly, so no harm done. Ceballos, now it's Pepe. Going through. Played in by... Up to meet it! Really well taken goal. Two to the good! They have breathing space. Oh, the cross was inch perfect. And the header unerring. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch. And it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. That has changed the dynamic somewhat. The crowd are calling for this to be put to bed. There's little sympathy about. That's Piliqueta. That's Uai. Forward it goes. Breaks on here. Decent progress down the left. Terrell. It will be. And he's there to cut it out. Away from immediate danger. Well, there's no sign here of forwards working back. They are staying upfield. They are, Peter, and it gives them a chance to, to break, but it's also causing a, an extra defensive presence to, to prevent that. Odoi gets good distance on it. And it's Hector Berrien. Pepe. Foul and a free kick in a very dangerous area. He knew what was coming. That's a yellow card. 
players protesting furiously, but there's little or no sympathy from the ref. The checks on the touchline, a change about to occur. Gunduzi stands over the ball, he'll be looking to dig one in. And he just whacks it away. Marcos Alonso goes looking. Odoi. It's a promising ball. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. A little accusatory stare there tells the whole story. Ah, quality deserted them when they really needed it. Hector Behrin, tries making a foray down the right. And it's Iwobi. Lacazette, timely intervention. Keeper gets rid without sophistication. Gunduzi. Bacuayi. Now it's William. And it's got through. Oh, that's lovely. Chelsea have decided now is the time to make their final change. Well, his stamina was called into question then, but there's absolutely nothing wrong with his heart and, and the effort he put in. He was very willing, though, not quite able. Struck first time! And he's there to make a great save. That's why he's very sporting. And time is up. Arsenal did it the hard way, a testament to their great powers of recovery. They have defied the odds. Well, how will we look back on that? Arsenal made their intentions clear that nothing else but a win would do. These games are always tough, you know, it's, it's not always about form, it's not always about class or style, it's about pride and they showed loads of that. Their attitude was spot on today.